back with my four month block update and I just wanted to come with you come to you with just a quick video of the changes that has been made and the changes I've noticed with my hair in this last month. I want to begin with um styling. I have not styled my hair much in this last month because I didn't feel there was no need to style it. Especially when by being cold, I've been keeping it tied up with my satin scarf. So maybe out of the whole month, I may have worn a headband maybe four or five times. Um, not all day, but like part of the day. Other than that, I really just styled my hair and it was pretty much tied up. Um, two, I do still moisturize my hair with Tali Waji Miss Body Fire Spray every day on a daily basis. Um, and <laughs> I also get moisture when I take a shower, I let my shower's hot and steamy, so therefore, no shower cap, no, um, do-rag or scarf on my head when I take a shower. When I get hot and steamy, my hair get hot and steamy, curls up, shovel up, whatever. Then afterward, I just apply my aloe vera, um, gel to my hair and tie it back down. Moisture. Um, I retied my hair about three, four days ago, and I've noticed that on the sides, I have no braid pattern. Well, that's bad or good? Hmm, I'm excited. <laughs> so, yeah, there is no braid pattern on the sides, and there is no braid pattern in the back of my hair. Um... Seems like the back is locking up. I keep finding these little buds all over the place. Drives me crazy. But um, that's exciting news. So it is locking up in the back, which means that there isn't any braid pattern in the back as well. So that leaves the front. The front, of course, there's a braid pattern. And I think it's because I don't lay on the top of my head. So the more I lay on the back of my head, the more it's going to scrunch up and tighten up and lock up really quick. Which I could switch and sleep on the top of my head so it all can lock up. Um, <laughs> um, the cold season. I want to challenge myself during this season. And this month, this month, um, hopefully I can pass. I want to challenge myself and to... <clears throat> not washing my hair until it's time for me to retighten really again, which will be in about five and a half more weeks. Since I try to keep my hair retightened every five to six weeks, try to make it last six weeks, so it's going to be hard to do. But I'm going to try my best to refrain from washing my hair until it's time for me to retighten. One reason is because I do not want to strip my hair of the natural moisture that it already has and by it being cold I don't want to make it worse so yeah don't need dry shedding hair right and the second reason why I want to do that is because I want to see the actual growth in my hair for at least that month and a half or what have you um these next five and a half weeks since I really can't get a real visual of how much growth I get in one month by constantly washing my hair because of course being in a lot it loosens up and my braid locks they get pretty loose where some of them I have to actually interlock the whole thing all over again well not the whole entire thing but um yes I want to challenge myself and do that it's going to be pretty hard. Um, another change that I've made, well, I've been oiling my scalp like every other day with my new growth oil that I bought from Wegmans, which you might have seen in my previous video. I will um, put a description in the description box for you because I can't, I don't, I know it's called G Grow G something, whatever. But I'll put that in the description box. I oil my scalp with that every other day. And then I'll 
my alabama gel in my hair and tie it down um some days uh if i don't use that i will use my sulfur a to oil my scalp because yes i do have a problem with g scalp um i really haven't had a problem lately with it um flaking up at all period so that's a good thing but my hair really does well my scalp really does soak up the oil so i guess he likes it i don't know we'll see um other than that uh i still i love my hair it's so amazing and i noticed that it has grown a lot and i'm super excited you may not notice that from here because it's and it's like <clears throat> really extreme shrunken state which i do like this because i can just yeah just do that and not worry about it um outside like besides when it's stretched out it's kind of hard for me to style it since it's still short but stretched i don't know if you understand that but it's kind of confusing me too so i just like it like this um it was something else oh yes after I retightened my hair and it was still in a stretch state, I accomplished a bunny tail. Now you look like a bunny tail. Well, since my hair isn't long enough for a ponytail, I call it a bunny tail. And it looks like a bunny tail. So I will show you a picture of that uh, somewhere at the end. But um, other than that, that's my experience in the last month with my brain locks. Next up, five months. Can't wait. Ooh. So, I'll see you guys in another month with another brain lock update. Can't wait. To those, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe.